No, it's not. No, it's oh, not. Oh, I can't, not I can't walk with you. How can two walk together unless they agree? Your Christ is not my Christ. My Christ is a Christ who forgives all sin. My Christ is a Christ who, is a, who shows partiality and says, I'll forgive your sins, but not his. You and I can't walk together here, brother. Hold on, brother. Let me give you one with one or two scriptures. Okay. The book of 2 Maccabees, chapter 7, verse 31. And thou that hast been the author of all mischief against the Hebrew. These people have been the authors of mischief against the Hebrew Israelites. Yeah. God's chosen people. They've been the authors of mischief, murder, rape, robbery, right. theft. Read on. Shall not escape the hands of God, Yahweh. They will not escape the hands of God. That's Daniel right. was a righteous man, wasn't he? Yeah. Did he still go into slavery? Was Jeremiah a righteous man? Did he still go into slavery? Was Ezekiel a righteous man? Did he still go into slavery? Brother? Do you think everyone on those slave ships was unrighteous? Was there no one on those slave ships that was righteous, brother? No, but the whole nation, the whole nation goes. The whole nation got to deal with it, brother. The whole nation got to deal with it. Give me Job 34, 29. Christ, Read that. Once for all? It's a book of Amos. Let's see. Let's chapter see. Chapter 9, verse 11. Let's see. Wait, wait, wait. If all God, wait, wait. If God, says gonna do, God? if God says he's going to do something, is he going to do it or is he lying? Does God not show partiality? Does God say he's going to do something and not do it? I think what you're suggesting is God is showing partiality for the black man and for the Latino. But for everybody else, to hell you. That's what it is. Uh, but that services. is not the God uh, of the Hebrews. No. Let's, read it. Let's, read it. The Let's read it. Let's read it. Let's read it. Let's read the Let's read the Bible. Let's see. That Let's see. Give me Deuteronomy 7 6. This is Deuteronomy. Jesus. Chapter 7. Wait, wait. Did your God say it? Help me Moses write Deuteronomy? I'm saying again. Did your God give Deuteronomy to Moses to write? Yes. Okay, let's read Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy, chapter 7, verse 6. For thou art a holy people. Oh, he said, the Israelites are a holy people. You know what holy means, brother? It means set apart. You got a favorite pair of shoes. You don't just go home and kick them off in a dirty corner. You might put them in the box, put the paper in the toes, put them on a little shelf, put a little LED light on them. Right. They're holy to you. <laughs> Read on. For thou art a holy people. He said, these people are a holy people. Unto the Lord thy God. Unto the Lord God. The Lord thy God has chosen thee. Oh, did the Most High God get partial? Read on. The Lord thy God has chosen thee. Read on. To be a special people. To be a what? A special people. Read on. Unto himself. Read on. Above all people. Don't run away. Read it say. Above all people. Told him, don't let him run away. Read on. Above <laughs> all people. Above all people. Read on. That are upon the face of the earth. Sounds pretty partial right. to me, brother. Sounds pretty partial to me. And Christ himself said he came for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Now let me tell you something, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Let me tell you something else. So wait, 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 don't get me wrong. The Bible says Acts 26, in all the other 16. nations. But rise and stand Wait, wait, what are, are you reading? What are you reading? For I have appeared unto thee for this purpose. Say what you're to reading. To make thee a minister and a witness, both of the things which thou hast seen, and back. of those things in the which I will appear unto reading, thee. Brother. Tell us what you're reading. Verse. Acts 26, 17. Oh, okay. Delivering thee from the people and from the Gentiles unto whom now I stand. No, keep reading, keep reading. Thee. Keep reading. Acts 26, 18. Uh -huh. To open their eyes. Let's read all the way to 22. And to turn from darkness and to light. And from darkness, that's right, and darkness to light. from the power light. of Satan unto God. Uh -huh. That they may receive forgiveness of sin. Right, read on. Go all the way to 22. Does brother. God forgive sin? Go right. Does read he on. not do it through the blood read of Jesus Christ? Read to 22, Christ? brother, please. Read on. An inheritance among them which are sanctified by faith that is in me. Why are you speeding up? Look, I sound like you're doing a Micro Machines commercial. Read on, brother. Whereupon, O King Agrippa, I was not disobedient unto the heavenly vision. Read on. But showed first unto them of Damascus and at Jerusalem. Hold up. And throughout all the coasts of Judea. Uh-huh. And then to the Gentiles. Uh-huh. That they should repent. Uh-huh. And turn to God. And no, keep reading. Keep reading. And do works meet and do for what? Repentance. Yeah. And do works meet for repentance. Read on. For these causes, the Jews caught me in the temple uh -huh. and went about to kill me. And read on. 
Having therefore obtained help of God, I continue on to this day. Wait, 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 don't run through it. This is it. Verse 22. Read it, brother, so everybody can hear you nice read. Loud. Read on. You chose this chapter, not me, brother. Having therefore obtained help of God, uh -huh. I continue on to this day. He continues on to this witnessing day. Witnessing both to small and great, uh -huh. saying none other things than those which the prophets Wait, saying Moses what, brother? Say it clear so everybody can hear you. Should come. Saying what? Saying none other what? Why are you running like a micro machine? None other things than those which the prophets and Moses did say should you come. You saying nothing different than what the prophets and Moses said. That's right. Which we just read in Deuteronomy. Right. Now, brother, you're cutting yourself. Word. You're slicing yourself. <laughs> you're cutting yourself. You did this to yourself. Wow. We just want to talk to you, brother. We want to tell you I'm God's chosen. We also go to verse 23. I or, want to tell you God's chosen people. Or do you feel people, like brother. running now? I want to tell you God's chosen people. Brother. That Christ should suffer and that he should be the first that should rise from the dead and should show light unto the people what is showing light and to the, to the Gentiles. What is showing a light to the Gentiles? Christ for the Gentiles. What is showing a light Christ to the Gentiles? Christ for the Jew. What is showing Christ the light to the Christ for all time. A complete work and sacrifice on the cross. Christ for the forgiveness of all sins. Yeah, he got to run. Christ for all people. He got to run. Christ for everybody. He got to run away. Come unto the Lord Jesus Christ and believe. He got to run away. Christ is not just for the Jew. Read Christ the Bible, brother. Just for the Why you stop reading the Bible? Christ for everybody. Let's show you what it is to be a light to the Christ Gentiles. Christ for Let's everybody. Read the Bible what it is to... okay, okay, wait, 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 no. If you're going to the Gentiles. Don't take me off. Oh, I the sound of my voice. Light to the Gentiles. Let's go to light. Look at him. Look at him. Let me show you. Let me show you what it is to be a light to the Gentiles. Save you from your sins. The Bible says what it is to be a light to the Gentiles. Let's read it at the Bible, or should we just let you just roll it off the side of your neck? Let's read the Bible. Read this. Isaiah Did chapter 60, verse 1. Bring it out. Oh, Christ, shine, for thy light is come. What's that? Like what is coming? For thy light is come. Read on. And the glory of the Lord. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 60. This is where you get the term light to the Gentiles. Read on. It's risen upon thee. Right. Read on. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth. The darkness is going to cover the earth. Read on. And gross darkness, the people. Gross darkness will cover the people. Read on. But the Lord shall rise upon but thee. But the Lord will rise upon thee. Who's thee? That's the children of Israel. Read on. And his glory shall be seen upon thee. And his glory will be seen on the children of Israel. Read on. And the Gentiles shall come to thy light. Read it again. And the Gentiles shall come to thy light. We're talking about being a light to the Gentiles. And read what? And kings and the brightness of thy rising. So they will come to the Israelites because they're going to be a light to the Gentiles, right? Let's see what that looks like, brother. Give me, give me verse, uh, give me verse 10. All right. Verse 10. And the sons of the strangers shall build up thy wall. And the sons of all those Gentiles are going to build up our wall. And their kings shall minister unto thee. What does minister mean? Minister means to serve. If I bring you some water and a sandwich, I'm ministering to you, brother. You I'm serving you. Is this is what you... it means. Is read on, read you, on, read on, brother. He don't yeah, like the Bible. Because read Jesus on. said, read on. Verse 12. He that would be greatest verse 12. of all will be least of For all the nation, the servant of all. Right. And kingdoms. You're that preaching that, 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 sir. You're preaching that some other man is going to We're reading the Bible. Say, and you hate the Bible. Why can't you Chapter be a 60, servant? Verse 12. Bring it out. For the nation and kingdom that will not serve. The nation and the kingdom that will not serve you, Israel. These shall perish. They shall what? These, These shall, shall perish. perish. What does light to a Gentiles mean? That means they're going to serve Israel or they're going to perish. Right. You don't know what you're talking about, brother. You need to read this Bible more. You need to study more to show yourself approved. Yes, That's right. right. You didn't know who was in Babylon. You didn't know what happened to the northern kingdom. You didn't know what any of these words are in Greek or Hebrew. Christ that you, and you serve here and I serve are different. I, I thou say it. Thou say it. Thou say it. I cannot thou walk say with you. Jesus thou say it. Thou say it. Thou say it. My Christ. Hey, hey, hey. For give me Jeremiah 13 and 15. My Christ. Give me Jeremiah is a 13 and 15. For anybody. Jeremiah 13 and 15. He's running away. Jeremiah chapter 13, verse 15. Get ye and get and get him. Be kept him. I gotta walk away from For the Lord has right, 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 spoken. I'll get you walking down the last day of the Greek. I don't agree with you. Hear ye and give ear. Hear ye and give ear. Be not Christ proud. Not don't be what? Don't be not proud. Be not what? Be not proud. Be not proud. Be not proud. Read on. For the Lord has spoken. No, some nigga said it on the block. For the Lord has spoken. No, some dirty ass nigga said For it on the block. For the Lord has spoken. Man, the Most High God wrote that. That's right. All praise to the Most High God. You blacks, you Latinos. And you Native Americans, you are the children of God. Hey, hey, the Most High God is calling you back to your true nationality. 
you got to follow the commandments, you got to keep the faith. If you come, if your father is from so-called black, Latino, or Native American descent, you descend from the 12 tribes of Israel. That's right. And you got to accept it. And you got to follow God. Zechariah 13 and 11. Because the Most High God said two-thirds of our people aren't going to hear this. Give me Jeremiah 17 and 4. Two-thirds of our people will not accept this. And they're going to die with their oppressors when the Most High God comes back. What's your nationality, King? I'm black. You're black. All praises. Your father's black, so-called black, right? And we know that black is not a nationality. I called up JetBlue. I asked for a round-trip ticket to the land of black, and they hung up on me, man. Can't you believe that? <laughs> Read this. It's a book of Syrac. Yes. Chapter 13. Verse 11. Oh, Zachariah. Oh, Zachariah. Read this. It's a book of Jeremiah. Chapter 17. Verse 4. Bring it out. And thou, even thyself, he's talking to the children of Israel. This is a prophecy of the chosen people of God. Shall discontinue. Shall do what? Discontinue. We're going to discontinue from thy heritage. From our heritage. That I gave thee. Right? The Bible in the Deuteronomy says we'll be called Proverbs and bywords. Black, nigger, African American. They made that up in the 80s. How am I older than my nationality? You think what I'm saying? Read on. And I will cause thee. To serve thine enemies. Did not our ancestors serve our enemies? God said the children of Israel will forget who they are. Now you ask all these other people where they're from. Oh, I come from Wales. I come from Germany. My grandfather is from uh, Uganda. They know where they're from. Uh, the children of Israel do not know where they're from. The children of Israel would not know where they're from. This knucklehead nut brother who we trying to talk to for an hour did not know where he was from. But he's telling me he needs to get a DNA test. He don't even know what the acronym DNA stands for. But the Bible tells us who we are. Our DNA test is in the Bible. God left it for us. He left a bread trail to who we are. And you know what? Just give me spirit, bear witness. Romans 8 and 16. 11 and 13 and 11. Uh, Zechariah 7, Zechariah 9, Zechariah 13, Zechariah 13, Zechariah 13, verse 9, no, yes, 13 and 8, brother, read this, it's the book of Romans, chapter 8, verse 16, the spirit is so, Bears witness with our spirit. That a spirit shall bear witness with our spirit that we are the children of God. Now you got to think about it. Why are our people, why are our men the strongest and the handsomest men? Why are our women so damn beautiful, more beautiful than Chung Lee and all that? Why is our food better than everyone else's food? Why is our music better than everyone else's right, music? Right, right. We see, watch her do the electric slide and tell me if you don't crack up laughing. You dig <laughs> what I'm saying? Our people are special. Why is that? God said we're the salt of the earth. But two-thirds of us are going to die with our oppressors if you don't remember you're the children of God and come back. Read this. Zechariah chapter 13, verse 8. Bring it out. And I shall come to pass. It shall come to pass. That's a prophecy. Read on. That in all the land, said the Lord. That in all the land, said the Most High God. Two parts therein shall be cut off. Two-thirds of our people will be cut off. And die. And what? And die. And what? And, and die. die. And die with their oppressors. For the rape, robbery, and murder they did, their judgment is coming to them. If you don't want to come out of these people, you're going to die with them. The Most High God said, you're the chosen. You are the people of God. And you got to remember you're the people of God. you got to feel it in your spirit. Give me salt to the earth, man. Make me Matthew 5. Read that. Wow. But the, le the two-thirds shall be left therein. But one-third will be left. Do you understand? Two-thirds are going to be cut off and die, and one-third is going to be left. Read on. And I will bring the third part to the fire. He's going to bring that third part to the fire. And when we find them as silver is refined. If you, if you refine silver in fire, it gets rid of all the dross. All the, all, the, all the impurities come out of it. And it's left pure and shiny. So putting fire to something will, will make it better. You understand? That's what he's doing with the one third. We have to wake up to who we are. We're not niggas. We're not spicks. We're not, we're not, we're not. Gang bangers, we're not thoughts and wops. We're the children of the Most High God. That's right! Why do they call it the judicial system? Because it's how we ran things in Judea. Hey, get that brother flyer. Get a brother too flyer. The, the sister and the brother? How you doing, Milton? All thanks to the Most High.
because they, they call it the judicial system because of how we ran things in Judea. You know what I mean? They learned how to run their military from reading our Bible and our Chronicles. They learned how to eat, how to cultivate everything from us. Right? You are a Jew. You are a true Jew, brother. You're a true Jew. That's right, brother. Y'all have a beautiful night. Y'all God's chosen people now. Remember that. All praise to the most high God. All praise to the most high God. All praise it. Let's make room for the next dynamic speaker. Give me one more. Give me two more before I get up out of here. Right? Give me Revelation 16, uh, Revelation 6 and 17. Right? What is what you got? Sorry. Give me that. It's book of Matthew. Chapter 5, verse 13. Bring it up. Ye are the salt of the earth. The most high God said the children of Israel are the salt of the earth. You know what salt does to that chicken? And you know why they chicken don't taste like our chicken? Because we put some of that salt on that thing. Right. We put some of that Lowry's on that thing. We put some of that Old Bay on that thing. That's that salt on that thing. Read on. But if the salt have lost its flavor, if the salt loses its savor, read on. Wherewith shall it be salt? What good is the salt? Read on. It is thenceforth good for nothing. The salt ain't good for nothing if it don't make your chicken taste good. So what God is saying is, but read on. But to be cast out, but to be thrown out, and to be trodden and step on under foot of so men. So God is saying that if you don't keep the commandments and the faith, you don't have your salt. You don't have your flavor. And you're no good. You're going to be cast out and trodden upon like the heathens who oppressed your people for hundreds of thousands of years. Right. So God is saying, come back to your salt. Who you are are the chosen people of God, and we got to act like it. Is that what I want? The earth, the earth, the earth. Right. Revelation chapter 6, verse 17. Bring it up. For the great day of his wrath. For the, what? For the great day of his wrath. That's the great day of the most high God's wrath. For the great day of his wrath is come. The great day of his wrath is coming. Read on. And who shall be able to stand? And who's going to be able to stand on that day? All praise to the most high God. Let the next mighty speaker come up here. Shalom. Shalom.